Hello guys, welcome to WindowsSiteExperts.com channel. This video is all about troubleshoot potential Windows Update database error detected. For more related videos, please subscribe, like and share to this channel. If you're facing issues downloading or installing Windows updates on your Windows 10 computer, and you run the Windows Update Troubleshooter or the Woo Online Troubleshooter to fix the issue, but instead of resolving the problem the troubleshooter itself throws up a message potential Windows Update database error detected or Windows Update components must be repaired. What do you do in such a case? Here are some troubleshooting ideas that you might want to take a look at. Potential Windows Update Database Error Detected 1. Run System File Checker To run System File Checker, you need to open Command Prompt with Administrator Privilege. To do this, search for CMD in Taskbar Search Box, right-click on Command Prompt and select Run as Administrator. Now you need to enter this command and hit Enter. SFC, Scan Out. This scan will replace all corrupted or damaged Windows operating files. Once the scan is over, restart your computer. 2. Run DISM. The DISM.x tool can be used in different situations, and one of them is to repair a corrupted Windows update files. Do note that you need to run a different command if you want to repair corrupted Windows update system files. If you run the usual, restore health command, it may not necessarily help. DISM will replace potentially corrupted or missing system files with good ones. However, if your Windows Update client is already broken, you will be prompted to use a running Windows installation as the repair source or use a Windows side-by-side -side folder from a network share, as the source of the files. You will then be required to run the following command instead. DISM.x, online, cleanup image, restore health, source, C, repair source, Windows, limit access. Here you have to replace the C, repair source, Windows placeholder with the location of your repair source. Once the process is complete, DISM will create a log file in %winder%-logs-cbs-cbs.log and capture any issues that the tool finds or fixes. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe, like and share with your friends.